Three, two, one. John's a strong, silent type, a man of few words. The Tiger King has quickly become the hottest show on Netflix because it's almost unbelievable. Want to know exactly how Joe Exotic used baby tigers? Keep watching for 10 of the darkest secrets from the Tiger King documentary. Carol's missing husband. Everyone is talking about what happened to Don Lewis, Carol Baskin's missing husband. But no one seems to talk about how toxic their relationship was from the beginning. Don was already married with children when he saw Carol walking down the street crying. He kept trying to get her in the car with him. They had an affair for four years before they got married, but Don was also unfaithful to Carol for their whole marriage. He even had a girlfriend down in Costa Rica. Don had money when he met Carol. Carol pretty much had nothing. Joe Exotic's parents. In episode one, Joe says that his relationship with his father was not great. When Joe came out as gay, his father shook his hand and made him promise not to come to his funeral. But years later, Joe was back to having a relationship with his mom and dad. This relationship was not exactly healthy, though. His mom said he would just give her papers to sign that she didn't even read. This got her into a huge financial bind. Doc Annals Workers my mentor in the animal industry. Joe Exotic considers Doc Annal to be his big cat mentor. Doc has several women that he considers his wives. They work 18-hour days, seven days a week. At one point, they lived in horse stalls with sliding doors. Doc controls what they eat and what they wear. One former worker said that she was forced into getting plastic surgery. They also have to call him Bhagavan, which apparently means Lord. Expired Meat one of the ways that Joe Exotic managed to feed all the big cats at the GW Interactive Zoo involved expired meat. He would get a big truck of recently expired meat from Walmart. This might be fine for feline predators with highly acidic stomachs, but his workers struggled to make ends meet. They would take meat off the truck because they couldn't afford much else. Later, when Jeff Lowe builds a pizza place on site, we find out that the meat on the pizzas was also expired. Ugh, gross. We aren't sure how the health department didn't shut them down. Political Publicity Stunt If Joe Exotic running for political office seems strange to you, you're not alone. Burr. Hello, America. Hello, ladies and gentlemen of America. Let me try that again. Hey, can you shut that up for a minute? It was weird for everyone in his life, too. At first, Joe tried to run as an independent in the 2016 presidential election. Then he turned his sights to the governor's office. He used graphic language in all his promos and handed out contraception with his face on it. But his campaign manager and other people close to him have said it was nothing more than a publicity stunt. Joe wanted nothing more than to become famous, and somehow he won 19% of the vote. Worker pay. The people who work with big cats put their lives on the line every day, but they get paid pennies. Joe's workers only made about $20 a day. He would provide them housing, but they were infested with pests and didn't even have working appliances. At least he paid them. Carol Baskin doesn't pay any of her workers. These volunteers must give up holidays and go through extensive training. They work long hours for no money. Want to know what happens to Joe's baby tigers? Keep watching to find out. Travis Maldonado Joe's second husband, Travis Maldonado, is one of the saddest stories from the show. Joe used Travis's addiction to keep him around. Travis was only 19 when they got married. He became depressed and felt very trapped. He had a habit of pointing loaded weapons at people when he was under the influence. But when he pointed it at himself, it ended badly. He said he didn't think it was loaded, but it was. Did he plan it all along, or was it really an accident? For the camera, Joe Exotic loves being on camera. He wants to be the center of attention all the time, and he was always putting on a show. He did it at Travis's funeral, but he also did a lot for the reality show that was being filmed. In fact, he would lose his temper and fire people just because he wasn't on camera. Jeff Lowe's motives. I'm not an angel, but God, put, put up your, your proof, you know? Stop talking about it. It's not clear how involved Jeff Lowe was in the plot to go after Carol Baskin. Everyone says something different, but it is clear that he wanted Joe out of the picture. He said it himself in the last episode. Then he went on and took advantage of Tim Stark after Tim paid for a new zoo. Baby Tigers 
One of the most heartbreaking moments of the series was when we learned what happens to tiger cubs. Joe was illegally breeding the big cats. When a tiger gave birth, he pulled the cubs away as soon as they were born. They didn't even get a chance to nurse. They cried nonstop the first few days because they were taken from their mothers. It was even suggested that he sold them to pay for the hit on Carol. Which moment in Tiger King left you most surprised? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the things for more great content. See you next time.